There's something else all of us can do uh, when we have an opportunity. And that is, if you have an opportunity to be on a jury, or you have a close friend who you uh, trust and, uh, and has the right heart, and they're going to be on a jury, uh, we can nullify these things. Uh, there's a marijuana situation, and you're on a jury, get on that jury, and you can unilaterally make sure nobody goes to prison for a marijuana yeah. offense. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's an opportunity we all have, uh, regardless of what happens in the election, and we have a really, uh, we have a really uh, significant chance of breaking into the top two on this. For, for those that, of you that are not aware, uh, the rules have changed so that now anybody can vote for uh, any candidate in any party for the um, congressional election. You don't have to be a libertarian to vote for a libertarian. We could end up having two Democrats or a, or a libertarian and a Democrat. But um, there's eight people in the, in the race that I'm in, and there's four Democrats, uh, one Republican, uh, one uh, declined to state, a, a Green, and I'm the sole Libertarian. Uh, the, uh, uh, I have somebody who worked both on the um, on a, on, on Obama uh, election team and a Bush election team working on my campaign. Um, we have um, some people. We have, we have uh, Greens, some are former Greens, working on the on the campaign, and um, uh, Democrats, Independents, and we have a real shot that we can be in the top two. What my belief is that um, uh, when we get top two, uh, it will get um, national, maybe international attention. Uh, we will get some serious funding, and um, I can win. Uh, one of the uh, blessings of this particular race is that uh, people thought Henry Wa think Henry Waxman is so formidable he cannot be beat, and he's Henry Waxman is um, very powerful. He's been in the, the Congress since 1975, yeah. and he's he's the ranking member of the uh, of the Energy and Commerce Committee, and in that committee are, are three bills right now. There's one bill legalize hemp. There's another bill focused on medical marijuana. And there's a third bill that's co-sponsored by Barney Frank and Ron Paul that um, is the uh, HR 2306, the Federal End Marijuana Prohibition Bill. And um, that would allow each state to decide its, its own law, its own rules with respect to marijuana. They could completely legalize, they could completely prohibit, they could make it only okay for medical marijuana. They could do a thousand and one different things somewhere in between those two ends of the scale. Each state would be one of 50 laboratories of innovation to figure out what works. Um, in this country right now, in the, in the time period that Waxman's been in office, the pop, our prison population has gone from 300,000 to 2.3 million. California alone, it's gone from like 25,000 to 160,000. Uh, you talk about education of kids. Um, the corrections budget used to be 3% of the budget in California. Now it's 11.5% of the budget. It, ex it exceeds higher education. Uh, the so the average um, prisoner costs $45,000 per year. To incarcerate, we spent eight thousand dollars per year on students. Forty-six thousand six hundred. Okay, there we go. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. So I'm a I'm a big believer in education, not incarceration. Uh, my my goal is to not only wind it back to where it used to be, which is about one fifth of the number of prisoners that we have, and it's going to take some time. Uh, but I'd like it to be one-tenth as much because we were so good at, at knocking down recidivism. California used to be the leading state in the country on recidivism. It was like 10 or 20 percent of the people went back. Now it's like 70 some odd percent. And um, so we have an opportunity to uh, get the person out of office that's stopping all this progress. And uh, I really appreciate you all uh, coming and uh, supporting me. And, uh, and keep in mind, uh, when you leave, no matter what you can do, always keep that, that idea of jury nullification in your head. Because yeah. each one of us can make a difference.
and um, that would, uh, you know, and if you talk about the, the waste government has arresting these people, and the law enforcement and the prosecution, at least you have a chance to keep somebody from wasting our money and ruining their life with prison time for doing something to their own body. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. Amen.